Hey folks, so welcome to the November 2017 Espresso Box Unboxing. Uh, Espresso Box, again, one of the consistent gentlemen's boxes that I, I always find um, almost never uh, failing to disappoint with at least one item every month. Um, so the one thing about Espresso Box, you know, uh, what I always try to do with these boxes is... Now, the one thing that each box does well, regardless of the box that I subscribe to. And the one thing about Spreza Box is they always try to give you an out-of-the-box experience. That is to say, everything in the box somehow should kind of fit together, um, either around theme, around pattern. So the idea is you, know, you take whatever's in the box, and you can pretty much wear it as an ensemble. Uh, so we're just kind of pulling in here and seeing what we've got. Um, so there's some sales stuff for an electric toothbrush. Here's our theme, the Martin. We've got some exciting things coming up here at Spreza Box that we couldn't have achieved without awesome members like you. This month we're thinking with a box full of character and variety of patterns to keep you looking fly. Well, I don't know if I'm allowed to look fly as a 45-year-old white male, but we'll see what's going on. Um, so let's just open this and see, uh, I'm just going to grab the very first thing I see here, and the very first thing I see is a tie from the Notary, and the Notary, I'm familiar with, I've had their ties before, so it kind of looks like almost a Heather. I like a heather brown, a heather blue, a heather gray in a stripe pattern. You know, that's not a bad thing. Um, for example, I can tell you right now, uh, with the vest that I'm wearing, uh, if I wanted to take the effort to squeeze my neck and take the effort to squeeze my neck, um, this, this tie would fit perfectly. Uh, you know, blue in the tie, fits the blue in the shirt. Uh, the gray hits the gray in the vest. Uh, the brown, you can't see it, but the brown hits the pants. Um, you know, it's just a nice tie. Uh, the heather, the kind of speckle on the color is a little, a little curious. Like, you know, not in a bad way. Um, kind of gives, I guess, a little bit of a visual texture. Uh, so I'm reaching in here. I'm grabbing the next thing. The next thing is from... <laughs> On stop. Socrates. S O C K R A T E S. So it's a uh, Argyle design. Again, we've got the blue, we've got the brown. So, you know, we're kind of themed with the colors in the tie. Uh, one thing I always do when I do socks is I try to give a the calves don't feel bad. Again, I could probably wear them bunched up around the base of the shoe. If I pulled it up, it would compress. But, I mean, the socks, the socks aren't bad. Um, kind of like the look of the sock. Uh, the next thing we see here, I'm just grabbing... Oh, there's a hidden box. Uh, I see what they got. Hold that thought. Uh, so the next thing we've got is... A cotton pocket square, and I now have to do this. So it doesn't look like it's blue, but I definitely see like a black. I see a black and a brown, kind of a, an alternating um, pattern. So yeah, as usual, again, everything kind of fits together. So you know, socks, tie, pocket square should all hit. Um, man, I'm just going to grab this. I have no idea. There is a box. The box has no identification. The box is making a shaking noise. And inside the box is a dog tag bottle opener necklace. When 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 did it become 2006, 2007 again? You know, 2006, 2007, is, is that too soon to even be retro? Man, I don't know what it is. 
Spreza is just really kind of trying to hit this this youth vibe. This is this is not the first time they've put something in the box that, at least for me, feels a little age inappropriate. Early twenty something male and fuck man, I don't, I don't even use the word. This this screams bro all over it. Um, this for me, not not exceptionally gentlemanly. Um, this this says frat guy who's got roofies waiting for you up in his room uh, and a couple of his buddies waiting up there as well. Um, not really feeling it. Yeah, it's kind of like the enamel pin that they put in. It was two or three boxes ago. Now they, they put an enamel pin in there. You know, Espresso box. Stop trying to aim for the fucking young crowd. Um, seriously, you know, you, you're not... You, you, you're not picking up the uh, the early 20-somethings. And, you know, like I said, this this says frat boy. This, for me, this says, you know, 18 to 21, maybe 22 years old, or if they're in Western Development, even in their mid-20s. Uh, I, I gotta say, this this is a severe misfire. Uh, again, kind of like with that enamel pen. Um, I'll, I'll grab this just to grab it. So the... Um, the toothbrush, I, I guess we now have to talk about this, um, is from Quip, and I, I've picked up Quip from a Bespoke Post um, months and months and months ago. Um, I, I've been given a tube of toothpaste, but there is no toothbrush. And I, I guess the idea is we are supposed to now go and buy the toothbrush for $25, and then it turns into a subscription service from there. So in other words, you, know, you pay them a certain amount of money every um, anyways, like every three months. Every three months, they send you a new head for the toothbrush. They send you another tube of toothpaste. Um, you know, I'm, I'm not really seeing the logic behind sending out the toothpaste. Uh, you know, I, I get that it, it lines up with this. Um, but yeah, th this is yeah two two stinkers. Let's uh, let's at least see what we've got in this. Oh fuck me, silly! Really? <sighs> okay, maybe not quite so much. All right, so we've got a lapel pin, and the lapel pin is at least mustache themed. Um, I I saw this and I kind of cringe because you know. Three minutes ago, I was I was venting about the fact that they uh, they they threw in a enamel pin. We hear enamel pins are cool among the kids, and we're putting one in there. And it's like a rocket enamel pin. It's it's still on my shelf. I took it out of the box, put it on my shelf, and it hasn't moved since. So originally, when I was looking at this, my thought was like, "Oh Christ, here comes another enamel pin." And the thing was, you know, when I um, I, I always want to make these videos, I always post the video on the vendor's page. You know, I at least give them an opportunity to respond, or at least make them aware that it's out there. Um, Spreza Box occasionally has responded, uh, but I had several people on the month that we got the enamel pin actually kind of also give me a WTF response with regards to the enamel pin. So, you know, I, I saw this and my thought was like, oh Christ, here we go, another enamel pin. But instead we have a lapel pin. Uh, the lapel pin has the mustache on it, so I guess... Um, this is kind of their passive way of participating in Movember. Um, you know, more more men's uh, products are a little more out with regards to their tie-ins to Movember. But let's look at the spoiler card. We might get a mention of it yet. Um, all right, so the Nottery, the Necktie, Retail 55. Um, I'll just go ahead and start putting these back in the box. You know, again... Interesting on the patterns, um, you know, because I, I tend to dress with a lot of neutrals. Uh, I'm okay with it. Um, still not really that jazzed about the kind of heather design on the color, but we'll see how it looks. Uh, so Spreza, the pocket square, th this is pretty much a standard for them every month. There's always some kind of a pocket square, and what I've noticed is at least over like the last year or so, pretty much all internally branded. Uh, Socrates, the socks, retail of $12. Uh, so lovely lapels. All right, um, lapel pin retail 12 We mustache you a question 
Would you ever grow your mustache out for an entire month without trimming it at all? If the answer is no, that's okay. We understand. We want you to make friends, not lose them. That's where this lapel pin comes in handy. It's a sure conversation starter and lovely lapels. Has more uh, pieces for sale on their site. That's great, but, you know, come on. The whole idea is, you know, you're supposed to be tying it into Movember. You know, the idea that we're doing something for men's health. That's why, you know, shave down, grow the mustache out. You could at least make a mention of Movember with regards to the mustache. Um, uh, the next thing we've got, the dog tag bottle opener. You know, again, the, the big trend of like 2005, 6, 7 when, you know, guys were wearing dog tags. Um, whether you're cracking open your favorite seasonal craft brew or getting ready for the big game with the boys... You'll always need to have a bottle opener handy for when the occasion calls. Hang this around your neck or keychain for easy access. Uh, yeah, I'm going to call this a, a misfire. Um, and then finally, <laughs> toothpaste. Quip Travel Toothpaste. Our best friends over at Quip have provided you with a travel-friendly toothpaste that features only the best ingredients. These guys are innovating the dental game with sleek electronic toothbrushes shipped on rotation. Head over to their website to improve your daily routines. Of course, the idea, the idea is you're going to go over and buy the toothbrush, but, you know, I already have one. Um, you know, again, not bad. Not the best box that I've seen from Sprezza. Kind of based on what they've said here, we've got some exciting things coming up. Um, this month we're thanking you with a box full of character and variety. Something tells me this is a leftovers box. Um, you know, they, they're just, you know, they're, they're transitioning over to something new, obviously. Uh, something tells me this is a quick transition box that they just kind of put out to put something out because they have to put something out. Um, you know, again, my, my big fear with Sprezza is... I'm seeing more and more stuff geared more towards younger males. Um, the enamel pin, uh, the bro um, dog tag bottle opener. I'm I'm really hoping they avert from that. You know, I'm not saying that everything has to be in the you know the 40s and 50s age demographic, but realize is a man of 45 years old. There are certain things that I just cannot wear without looking like the guy who's 45 years old. Who wishes he was 25 and I'm afraid that bottle necklace opener clearly falls in that category um, so you know the box is okay uh, you know like I said I, I've seen better uh, that, that, that is the polite way that I will put it here um, if anything they've kind of lowered the bar really good for December so maybe December's box will be better so uh, that is the Martin for November of 2017 so if you would like Go ahead and leave some comments down here. I'm sorry, go ahead and hit the subscribe button down here. Uh, if you would also like to leave comments, I'm trying to engage people when people leave them. Um, beyond that, I will see you all next month for the December 2017 Espresso Box. So until then, be good. Be good to each other. Stay safe out there.